This video is about fake light. Now what happens is that it becomes too hot outside that we just spend so much doors, so much time indoors with fake light or just no light. Like if the curtains are drawn to stop the sun, then there's going to be no light at all. What happens is your eyes, they become, they become weak and everything we see is based on light fragments in the atmosphere and we make the image that's how TVs work you've got the different light patterns and they merge into one and we see the face we want to see now the only natural thing in life that we need to see is the Sun because that allows us to see everything else everything is based on light and light comes from the Sun so if we're spending so much doors so much time indoors with the fake light our eyes are gonna be blind and we're gonna start having to wear glasses for no reason Okay, you don't need to wear glasses, we just need to be in proper light. Now, it's called blue light, which is fake man-made light, like TV light and light from the lamps and bulbs. It's not good, yeah, we can see, but in terms of our eyes, our eyes are supposed to only see things from the sun, like the sun is so powerful. We can see things so far away, we can see things so close, but if we spend so much time indoors in fake light, you go outside, you can't even see anything, your eyes are blurry because you're seeing things with the wrong light. It's dangerous. If it's too hot, we stay indoors, fake light, and we stay indoors anyway when it's cold and when it's rainy. So we're not getting proper light. And this is why so many people are going blind or they're just wearing glasses all the time because you know, they're in their bedroom reading their book on their PlayStation, fake light. And we're just causing our eyes to deteriorate because we're not using them, it's a muscle, we're not using them in the way that we should do. And our eyes work with light, with sunlight. Everything we see is from light, which is because of the sun. So sleeping with your curtains open at night time is powerful because it gets you gets your body and your and your, your room full of light and you become in sync with the universe rather than relying on fake light at five in the morning, setting an alarm for five, going to the office and it's dark. Like some people these days, they get up so early it's dark, yeah? And then they spend so much time in an office, fake light, and then when they leave work, it's also dark. That is so bad. And all these people, they wear glasses because they're staring at fake light and they're indoors with fake light. Now the sun is so powerful, I can't stress how, how important it is to be in natural sunlight, fake sunlight. Like fake light was only created so man could, could do things after, after, after dusk. Like it's a smart thing, you know, we can do things after dusk, our days could be longer. But there's, for every action, there's a reaction. Everything has an effect, a butterfly effect, right? If you spend too much time under fake light, your eyesight will just deteriorate because you're not using your eyes in the way that they should be used. Like we're the only living thing on the planet which uses fake light to see. Like animals, they can, like birds in the sky, they've got such good eyesight, they can see from miles away. Birds, cows, dogs, everything, it's all based on natural sunlight. You don't see these animals going to the doctors, do you? Like, you know, how many natural wild animals have like, you know, retina issues where their eyes go gray and cloudy like dogs? I'm convinced that it's only because of man-made light. Let's think about it, if, if the doctor spends all day at home on the bed, waiting for the owners to come home, in the dark or in the fake light, his eyes aren't going to be used in the way that, in the way that they should be. Whereas, how many cows have that issue? Probably not many because of the natural light. And if you don't get light, things die. Like trees, everything needs light, sun, grass, flowers. So why why are we any different? We're not any different. Okay, we are genetically very similar to a banana. Okay, and obviously a banana is a tree, which says that we are we are all made from the same things. And although it's smart that man's created light indoors, it's not good. We need to be out in sunlight as much as we can. We don't need to like sit in the sun for hours, but if there is sunlight, we need to be outside, okay? We can get outside, get outside. We spend too much time indoors in our little comfort zone with our little photo frame on the wall and our little dog on the couch and our husband upstairs and our kids in the bath. Yeah, that's lovely, very lovely. But in terms of humans, <laughs> Humans are fucking up the world. Humans are killing everything. And we need to get out in sunlight. Otherwise, things are gonna change. Times are gonna change. Humans are just gonna end up dying. Like, we become so smart that we're gonna kill our own race. And it's very, very dangerous. So we need natural sunlight. Otherwise, your eyes are just gonna fuck up. If you're on Facebook, like my page, so when I post new videos, you will receive them. This is my 88th video. I'm doing one video every day for 100 days. 12 videos to go. If you're on YouTube, 
subscribe right here and watch my YouTube videos that are going to come up at the end. Check them out. They're going to be some that you're not going to want to miss and they will change your life, trust me.